Hello and welcome to another installment of Thursday Throwdown. I'm your host, Sexy Ranch Hand Calder Ness. This week, I am going to be building from Justice League, and Simeon is building out of Avengers, and that is the OG 2007 very first carded set. So we have officially ended the non-carded Golden Age era, and we are now on to the really weird card stock cards era mm, of Shiro so Thick. Clips. They are very thick, and then the impossibly hard-to-turn dials that is the weird H thing under the dial that you need, like, a Lego brick or one of those specialty rings in order Literally to turn... Literally made a piece of jewelry just to yes. turn hero clicks. Yeah, yeah, yes. Yeah. It's, still buy them for it is cheap. awful. If you're like, I really want to flex my uh, OG hero clicks cred, here's one of these cool rings with all these weird yeah. divots on it. They'll say WizKids and Heroclix on them, too, if you want to, you know, wear that bling, ladies and gentlemen. So, uh, you, I know you, everybody's thinking at home, who won the non-carded era? Well, you'll be happy to know we played nine games, which means there is a definitive winner. Thank goodness. Simeon coming in second place <laughs> with four wins. Versus me, that's right, Calder Ness, ladies and gentlemen, coming in at first place with five wins. It was close. It was really close, and I, I would say that, that it was the sinister game of all games. That was the closest, and that's what gave me the clutch victory. I will claim my prize after the show. Thank you, everyone, that rooted for me, making me the non-carded Heroclix champion. The next era will be uh, all the carded sets until, and I don't know if I want to do this, until four... Or until we get Oreo bases. It depends yeah. how many episodes that's going to be. But basically, we could go that's going to be until Hero Clicks died for a bit. Or, that seems or no, fair. <laughs> yeah. Like I think until Hero Clicks dies. Yeah, we'll call so, it the the Hero Clicks death champion. Basically, the or, or the first or the first carded era, something like that, and then we could do the resurgence era type deal, the yeah. NECA era or something like that. I guess this is all the NECA era. Anyways, Simeon, you're building out of Avengers. Who is on your team? Who got the most oh, votes? Man. Who got the most votes was Black Panther. And we'll get to him in a second. I just want to point out, when uh, we we said that these would have cards, I was like, oh yeah, we'll get some traits, we'll get some special powers, we'll get some stuff going on. No, 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 no. I think over half of the figures from these sets, like I'm just clicking through a few here, I think over half of these figures at most have one special power, but a lot of them don't have a special power at all. And if they, they do, it's for like one or two use, clicks. Yeah, they didn't want to like make anything two power like full. Like just for example, let's look at Crossbones. On his last two clicks, he can uh, use mind control, but can't target. But can target only an opposing character that has the same team symbol as a friendly character. So like, wow. Worse mind control. So, he gets worse mind control for two clicks. So powerful, <laughs> yeah. So like they were like, this is what he needs. I'm sure, it, like I'm sure it was in reference to like a storyline that was happening. But uh, let's get into the Avengers team, uh, not actually a theme team. So starting off with the Chance McCall pick of the this week was number zero five zero Winter Soldier. He's got ten range. One lightning bolt, that's right. He can shoot as far as uh, cosmic people in modern age. Uh, it starts off with some stealth, some super strength, because he's got a robotic arm, some ranged combat expert to help him hit, some toughness, goes into willpower with running shot mid-dial, charge with this special power, that is give Winter Soldier a close combat or ranged combat action. Before making this attack, you can modify Winter Soldier's damage value by plus one if you deal one unavoidable damage to an adjacent friendly character. It's mm. kind of like take some, get some, uh, you know, ebb and flow. So uh, we might we might use that on like a, I don't know, like a thug or something if we get to that power. Uh, next up is Scarlet Witch. It had two votes for her, and you can see why. 35 points, three clicks of prob, five clicks deep, Avengers team ability... Uh, some mid-dial barrier, that might come in handy. And she's a carrier, a flyer. Uh, eight range, one lightning bolt. So, I mean, really not a slouch. Nine for two is not bad for 35 points. And, eight range, yeah. Yeah, what we've, and, what we've um, seen. Even 13 years later, she is still the cheapest figure uh, with the Avengers keyword and prob. So. Yeah, yeah. That's very true. Let's 
Let's take a look at these guys, I suppose. So here's Winter Soldier in his classic uh, Play-Doh bodysuit with his Cyclops <laughs> visor and what <laughs> appears to be um, just some mishmash of gun. I don't, I don't think that's a specific gun. It looks like he combined three of them. So it's just some sort of gun thing. But mm. yeah, pretty mm. good, pretty good uh, Winter Soldier there. Um, pretty impressive. Uh, the Scarlet Witch. This is, of course, like the uh, the classic style Scarlet Witch. The other Scarlet yes. Witch in the set being the Ultimates version, who is more like uh, the emo and goth of uh, MCU Scarlet Witch. Uh, this is like the the classic Scarlet Witch, you know, when she would look up at the sky and her face would turn into <laughs> horrible. <laughs> I don't. Know. Uh, that's a pretty bad sculpt. I'm not gonna lie. Um, For a super rare, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> this is this was a super rare. She's on a flight base. Um, uh. Man, they really. I mean, I want to say they nailed the face, but like, don't beat up on her too bad. They nailed the face <laughs> with like a ten-pound hammer, at least. I don't. <laughs> it was. It's, it's. I mean, it's not the best we've seen. For thirty-five points, I guess it's not too bad for that. For that cost, Stardust is going to be my heavy hitter of this series. So he's got power cosmic. He's hundred and seventy-one points, eight range. So. Over double the cost of Winter Soldier and not quite the same range. Starts off with some phasing, flight, uh, pensai, 19 mm. with super senses, which I really like. This mid-dial regen, I hope oh, wow. that I wow. hit yeah, wow. a 12 pulse wave if you... 12, <laughs> 12 for 4. Pulse wave. Yeah. Jeez. Uh, he's got some close combat experts, so you don't want to base him but you kind of want to base him. And then he the ends Pensai, with Pulse yeah. Wave as well. So there is wow. a click of 5 damage Pulse <laughs> five Wave. 5 damage. Except it's an 8 attack, so I'm probably rolling my regen on that click. I'd rather have hey, Hypersonic. when you're down dial, I'm down dial, right? So I mean, that if five he ends like, up... We'll have to see, but... If he yeah, ends up being like the, the last figure and your last figure, and I don't have to worry about damaging anyone else, for sure. 5, eight, five 8 attack, D. Pulse Wave, we'll do it. <laughs> Uh, so th he really isn't, I mean, again, I have no mm. idea what this is, by the way. Um, alien dude. He's got like an axe spear thing. He, I'm assuming he's some sort of herald of Galactus because Galactus was in this set. Uh, again, he's listed in the set. Um, so there was a couple heralds, Silver Surfer also being in the set. Um, Terrax, Fire Lord. Uh, so... I'm assuming he's a he's a herald that I just never read about, but um, he's actually pretty solid for his points, in my opinion. Um, just no move and attack top dial kind of hurts. And then we've got Black Panther. So this guy comes in at 92 points. He's got the Spider-Man, which is the wild card team ability. Zero range, but he's got Perplex that goes to Outwit, and then Perplex, and then Outwit, so... At any point in my dial, I've got something I can use. He's got some blades mid-dial, blades on the back end. He's got toughness up front. He's got super senses in the middle. Um, just a full dial of leap climb, which I kind of wish he had a little bit of stealth. And I guess technically you could wildcard him with like a Batman team or Batman family uh, mm. team or something and give him some stealth. But he's actually got one of the better looking sculpts that I've seen in a while. Um, mm -hmm. crouching on like a little piece of terrain there pretty sweet a lot of like a lot of little details going on even though it's all black so you can't really make it all of them out it's still pretty sweet and then we go to my favorite of all of these the two gun kid so the reason why I really wanted this guy on the team I don't think anyone voted for him, but I really wanted him on the team, oh, okay. and that is because he has two special powers, count them, two, uh, Whoa. Real, real special, so not only does he have the modified boot symbol, which is like the carrier symbol or something, I, I yes. don't remember, yes. and with that you could use, I think, I'm not going to look it up, but you could use hypersonic, but when you did, you took a minus two to your attack um, yep. for the transport symbol or something. Um, 
So we won't be playing with that. Or at least oh, I why not? I won't why not? It. <laughs> it's a golden uh, age game. Why not? Because I've got I've got pretty bad attack values all the way down. Yeah, I don't know if you want uh, to attack top dial with the. He does have a special attack from the get go that goes through his whole dial, and that is fanfire. Uh, give two gun kid a ranged combat action. He makes two separate ranged combat attacks as free actions, making two separate attack rolls against two different target opposing characters. Resolve the first attack before making the second. So it's like flurry. You gotta you gotta target two different people. He's got six range, but I could potentially flurry for two damage twice, and then mid dial to his last click. He's got faster cyclone. That's the name of his horse, of course. Uh, quote unquote horse. Two gun kid is not carrying another character. Modify his speed value by plus two. So that's pretty cool. He can also use that in addition to his hypersonic. So. Or modifying mm. hypersonic for that so. late dial eight speed six attack. Heck yeah, baby! Yeah. So let's let's take a look at his horse because it's pretty impressive. Uh, it's on a on a steel horse I ride. Um, oh, this version the other handles cut off. Yeah, oh, that sucks. <laughs> it's rough, man. Well, he's got a gun in one hand. What's he gonna do? Yeah, ride but still, a, a bite ride with two handles. <laughs> it's impossible. Okay. Okay. Uh, no, he's actually a pretty cool sculpt though. Then I, I just needed filler, so I threw in um, the bad version of Stardust, and this is Lambda Zero. He starts off with Pulse Wave. He's got Super Senses, but only an 18 defense, full dial of phasing, uh, goes to some Energy Explosion, never gets above a 9 attack, dips down to an 8 quicker than I'd like, and then a 7. He's only 75 points, so he's, again, under uh, almost 100 points less than the Stardust version. But um, he's got a pretty long dial, and he's got six range, so this was apparently a Judge exclusive. It is the exact same sculpt as the previous one that we looked at, Stardust, so... Uh, it doesn't make me feel very exclusive. Okay. No, it doesn't. Um, occasionally, the Judge exclusives were actually like something that you really, really wanted. Um, and then, last but not least on my team is Thug. Are you sure? Are you sure not least? Are you, are you 100? So I actually really like Thug. Thug was the first bystander I ever pulled, and he was on every single team I had for a very long time. I like Thug. I, Thug has gotten kills before, so I expect Thug to do well in this game. I hope I anyways. Mean, he has potential. I may straight right. up murder him just to increase Bucky's oh. damage for one turn. Ooh. Ooh. But, uh, or for Ouch. one attack, I guess. Ouch. But uh, <laughs> seven points, four range... 8 speed, 8 attack, 16 defense, 1 damage. He's really not, like, a huge slouch. Um, no. The 1 damage being, like, my team's not really super well prepped to boost his damage, but... Uh, all, unless you want to use Black Panther's Perplex on, on Tom right. Bug's damage. Yeah, so so he's not, like, pumping out a ton of damage, but he's not, like, a... Not a terrible attacker, and he's a little speedy. He's got a defense that's high enough to survive. He's not the worst bystander we've seen. All right, well, I am building out of Justice League, and my first figure is going to be the one I also get the most votes for, and that is going to be Oots Batman. That's right, O-O-T-S, a.k.a. Oots Batman, or Out of the Shadows being his special speed power, which reads, once per turn when Batman occupies hindering terrain and is given any action that is not a free action, before the action, you may place Batman in any square of hindering terrain six or fewer squares away, to which he has a, line, a clear line of fire. So I could be, say, uh, I'm going to give Batman a close combat action and then zip, zam, move six squares over to you, who's next to some hindering terrain, and then punch you, which is pretty cool, which I kind of dig. Same thing with a range action. And he also has the Batman ally, two ability, which is really cool, six range. No, uh, you know, indomitable. Didn't exist yet. But the 11 attack, three damage top dial with outwit, I really, really dig. And down dial, his attack value dips to its lowest when he has close combat expert. And then it's a solid 10 attack with flurry. So he's a close combat beast. Look at those keywords, baby. Oh, boy. Uh, he's a, he's actually so a really many. solid 75 points. And I see why people uh, voted for this Batman. He is, he's really cool. I hope the Oots trait or the Oots special speed power uh, really pulls Batman's weight. Now, he's the chance McCall. Too. Yeah. He I is, mean, he can... right? Yeah. 14 speed top dial with that uh, special speed power if he's in the right spot. 
Yeah, exactly. Uh, and the Chance McCall pick this week is 039 Bat Zaro. Very cool. What a guy. He's, uh, I thought he was supposed to be floating upside down, but that's a different Batman. Uh, as you can see, his point value is 69. Nice. And he has the <laughs> special uh, speed power, which is actually a damage power, so fix that, HC Realms, uh, which is useless belt. Bazaar can flex, right? Like, uh, and he can modify common values only by a negative one. No monster keyword, question mark, question mark, question mark, sigh. Missing the monster keyword, sad face. I just want, no one said to fix it. No oh, one said man. anything about fixing it. Actually, I'm not really reading these, so me well, hate Bazaar. Well, too many words, okay. to be honest. Uh, cool fig. Too bad he didn't hit enhancement instead of... Uh, Batzaro the... am have the monster keyword. Batzaro am a good use of 69 points. <laughs> nice. Uh. Batzaro am have a very complicated dial. I don't, I'm not, I'm not going to keep that up. Anyways, he's got like chains. So it's like he's being weighed down or they're floating up or whatever. Either way, it's actually kind of a batman -y sculpt. Even though he's supposed to be the opposite of Batman, right? It's like that could just easily be a Batman sculpt. The I bat like symbol the, the is, bat upside symbol is upside down. down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's it's pretty it's a pretty neat sculpt and actually a figure I own. Very nice. I forgot to I forgot to do a nice quick uh, scope of your first Batman. Oh yes, Batman. Batman. The, just the Out cape of the over the shoulders. Yeah, this is a Oops. classic looking Batman. Um, like an older comic style. Oh yeah. Back when he was blue and gray. Uh, I prefer yes. the blue gray look as opposed to black gray or all black or whatever. Blue gray is best. Blue gray is the best one. Next up, we have my favorite. Bump, 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 bump. Oh, that's sale. Uh, whatever. Doomsday. <laughs> you know the song. Anyways, uh, Doomsday clocking at 261 points, which is pretty cool that Bat Zaro had a 9 in his point value to actually even it out. And this is what I like about old games and their point values are both weird but they both fix each other. Uh, he has the first type of stop clicks when he can use inv invulnerability. This is unstoppable, unstoppable uh, special defense power. Uh, he can use invulnerability when you turn Doomsday's combat dial. As a result of him taking damage, stop turning the dial when unstoppable appears in the stat slot. So first ever, I don't know if this is the first character to have stop clicks, but this is the first time I'm reading a stop click on an old figure he has really weird stats because he starts off super weak. Kind of like how Doomsday only had one arm in the beginning and he was just kind of leaping around, wasn't really fighting or anything. And he goes down to get some flurry, some quake. His damage value is the highest at the beginning, but can be bumped up to a six uh, down there at the end when he gets close combat expert. He, his stats are super weird. They fluctuate all over the place. Two damages, three damages, fours, fives. It's great. Defenses is actually pretty solid. I like that starting 19. I like the starting Battle Fury. Overall, Doomsday is just great. He is the beast brick powerhouse of the team. Let's take a look at that beautiful sculpt, which is when something's face. Too. He does, actually. Unlike so, Bats are. And Monster. Uh, so this sculpt is actually really good. And I really, really, really dig it. He's got the claws in his hands through Superman's cape being all ripped up. And he's got them big bony, spiky knees and the garbage of Metropolis and wreckage and stuff. It's great. Yeah. I love Doomsday. Doomsday's awesome. You can probably easily tell why I like Doomsday. Doomsday's the best. Because so. he kills Superman. <laughs> That's exactly why. Oh, okay. uh, let's see. I KO'd Green Scar and someone else with this guy. Wow. Good job, Supersonic33. Uh, let's let's find one that was oh. from someone that we know. Let's find a. There's a lot of comments. We'll find we'll there's, find some. Oh, fun. Ross dot dot. dot. Oh, Great really? Piece. Enjoyable. <laughs> uh, uh, man, I think that's. I'm not seeing Professor Aragorn indeed. or. Uh, who's Darth Saber. Darth Saber. Yeah, Darth where's Saber, he at? Yeah. Found out man. Darth Saber is still very active on HC yeah. Games. So from the beginning. Uh, started from the bottom, now he's here. Darth Saber's still kicking it on HC Realms, so congrats to Darth Saber. Uh, even though he didn't comment on Doomsday. I'm giving Sadly. Him a pass uh, on we, besides his normal unstoppable defense power, we also have the unstoppable feat on Doomsday, which basically lets me destroy a piece of hindering. So I ignore hindering terrain for the effects of movement anyways, um, but then when I'm given a move action, I can make a close attack against blocking terrain as a free action, and if the attack succeeds, the character can continue the rest of its movement, if any, 
after making the attack, so I can continue through the blocking terrain, Wait. which means I I don't What's have to comment? make an attack. What is so the, you what, used to have what was to, the defense for the blocking terrain? That's what I was curious about as well. So I don't know if certain maps had certain defense values for blocking terrain or like what it was. But um, it's really great with Hulks and Supermans, uh, as you can see. Uh, <laughs> I was, but, yeah, I was so hoping I, there was a comment just... that was like, uh, oh, yes, blocking terrain used to have a static defense of 12 or something that like that. Nice, right? Yeah. Uh, but no, we have no clue what the static defense is. But as we know, it's just a three damage to destroy. So it makes it much easier. And then the last figure, not the well, last physical figure on my team is Kronos, who gives me that much needed probability control, the that beautiful flight carry team ability. And then his, you know... <laughs> Because apparently when you give someone a special power down dial, it can still be the same as the normal power they already had. It just has to be slightly worse. So he can use probability control, but only when he is the character for whom, for whom, whomstative, the original role was made, or when he is the target of an attack. So he can only prob his own attack rolls or attacks targeting him down dial, which kind of sucks. He has Injustice League, which is great, because he'll need to be rolling 10s when he has a 9, 8, and 7 attack value. <laughs> Yeah, removing those tokens like crazy. Yeah, uh, yeah, I do like that they kind of tried to make the like when they first started doing cards and they were like, we're gonna do special versions of the powers. They tried to make it like somewhat thematic, so uh, they kind of they kind of like nailed it with uh, so making it I don't worse than the Kronos regular power is or or whatever. But he does have something to do with time. He's got like clock on his forehead. He's on a sundial type deal as his hoverboard, which is really which I dig. I think he has an hourglass on his chest, and it's kind of like the Kronos, I don't know if it's the Greek god of time, or whatever version of, I don't know, mythology it is, where Kronos yeah. is the time dude. But yeah, it's cool. I don't know him as a DC character, but... He's a Titan, you know, I think, in, in uh, Greek, uh, whatever, uh, but... So it's weird that they he put it... He's on a flight base, and they put him on a yes. peanut base, when he clearly... With a flight base, like, anything that Would goes it, he on a flight base it, could right? fit on he totally a, a doesn't normal need. base, yeah. Yeah. Um, I guess they do just... that with some people too. When they had like horses for sculpts, like a flying Pegasus for some people, or oh, yeah, yeah. whatever, they would make them double bases. Like you I don't do, need to. But, I okay. do want to take a look at one of like the cards. So we're just mm. going to pull up his card real quick, just to show you um, this blank page where the card should render, but it has the computers not. killing it. Uh, it is. It's it's pretty solid. <laughs> we'll we'll try that with uh we'll try that with someone else. We'll see if I can okay, pull up uh, a, any card. Um, I just wanted to see the big maybe what the, what the back of like the card looked like. Oh, see that's that was the best part about these cards, or not? Yeah. Okay. I guess I guess no. Um, so yeah, I can't really zoom in too much. Nope. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> we'll try. Um, as you can read here, this is Stardust. <laughs> um, so what they used as to do you can is see, clearly they they gave them they started off with giving them flavor text, which is something they still do. Uh, and then here they would give them like you know their standard like kind of like a, an important issue. But what you can't read at all right here was like a backstory, and it would be like. Um, so, like, let's say this is, like, Superman. And so everyone knows Superman's backstory. They're not going to tell you Superman crash-landed to Earth after the planet Krypton was destroyed and his parents saved him by sending him. Like, they're not going to say that. So they're going to tell you about this specific version of him. And so they would tell you kind of, like, it often would be, like, what was going on in the comics at the time. So it would kind of give you, like, a sweet backstory. Um, kind of, like, like, let's say if... This is a bad example because I don't know really anything about Stardust. But like, let's say this is like Stardust after he first became Galactus's herald. It would tell you like you know like Galactus came to his planet and destroyed it, but he was uh, eating lunch at the time, so Stardust became his herald. And like just little information like that is really cool. And you can't see it because uh, well, you're just gonna have to you're gonna have to go somewhere else to see it, I guess. Like Your imagination realms. truly is a wonderful thing. Yeah, <laughs> but look All how right, much, uh, look how much info team. they gave you. There's like look yeah, at a Kronos. ton about Chronos. So if you're really curious, because I don't know anything about him, no. So if you want to, boom, knowledge is power, ladies and gents. Leslie, let's skip Leslie. Rocky Davis, that's the nickname we're talking about. So Rocky here is truly a boxer among men with flurry, nine attack, fifteen defense, combat reflexes, light on his feet, uh, one damage. So I, this is a heck of a bystander. Two printed powers that both go wonderfully together makes him excellent tie-up 
Behold. I mean, like, come on, dude. How is this guy not having any comments? He's amazing. He's a great yeah. bystander. I don't yeah, know, like... because for three less points, I have the thug who has four range, eight speed, eight attack, uh, 16 defense, and one damage. But for three more points, this guy's got flurry and close combat expert, so not only is he a great tie-up piece, he can actually dish out, you know, two damage per turn if he's Nick, like, you know, making those attacks. Um, if you combine this guy with, like, some Empower or, like, a Perplex even, he's actually kind of like a little force to be reckoned with. Right? He's awesome. Be good and that, those are those are the teams, ladies and gentlemen. Look at that neck. Look at how yeah. just astronomically thick this man look that, is. Look at that Cal L uh, curl Esk he's got going on. Curl. Yeah. yeah. Look at that uh, little little time hourglass on his shirt. Is he a friend of Kronos, perhaps? Maybe. Uh, we The world may never know. We can't read the back of Kronos' card to say if he's best friends <laughs> with Leslie Rocky Davis or not. When Kronos first but, came to Earth and met <laughs> Leslie Rocky Davis. <laughs> yes, I, I imagine that was the back. He was like, hey, you want to see my turtles? You check out my turtles. And it's like, oh, okay. And they saw Leslie's turtles and they were like, oh, wow. He went the distance. He can go the mile. All right. So, Simeon won map rule. Same thing as last week. We each had a, one map for our entire set. So, oh, dude, that's brutal. <laughs> Batman fan, that's brutal. We each had a map for our set. So, we are playing on the Avengers uh, outdoor compound thing. So, yeah, Simeon won map rule. Let's, let's get right to it, ladies and gentlemen. All right. So, I started off my formation with my three flyers up front. Of course, I've got... Stardust and uh, Stardust Jr. And then I've got Scarlet Witch. All carriers. Okay. Uh, technically, Two Gun Kid can carry as well, but he can't fly, so all this hindering was going to be a problem. I'm just going to check some speeds real quick because I forgot to do that. Uh, not Winter Soldier. I don't need that. Um, seven for Scarlet Witch. We've got a ten phasing for Stardust. And Lambda. Zero is also ten phasing, so I can get pretty far. We'll go one, two, three, four, five, six. We'll go ahead and plop Scarlet Witch down right here. I have faith in her. I think she'll live for a small amount of time. Uh, Calder definitely doesn't want to take out my prob first thing. She's also carrying nope. Black Panther. Ooh. One, two, three, four, five, six. She can only move six squares. So she's actually going to be right there when she carries Black Panther. Because mm. um, it's minus one to speed when you move. Uh, let's right. see. Stardust will also move up to right there where I was going to position someone else, but I uh, did not for obvious reasons. He's going to carry Mr. Winter Soldier. Put him on those heavies. Can't pick him up yet, but uh, maybe. Uh oh. Maybe. My mouse is sticky. It's not letting. It's not letting <laughs> go of Winter Soldier. All right. And then Lambda Zero will also follow suit, carrying up <laughs> the Two Gun Kid. I'm just gonna plop him right here. He can't use. Wow, a heavy. He has no reason. Wow, wow, wow. This is a 500-point game, so I will yes. also move up my thug. It ain't easy being a thug, but uh, this nope. guy, this guy makes it look good. So he's gonna go mm. one, two, three, four, five, <laughs> six, seven. Why, why didn't you? <laughs> and eight. Why why did you put him in this corner? <laughs> <laughs> he can't fly, Calder. He had to Yeah. I had to decide yeah, had someone wasn't going to get carried. And you... <laughs> someone wasn't going to get carried and it was him. He had to walk <laughs> around the hindered. Um <laughs> uh, Wow. Just wow. All right. Do you have any anything else for your turn? Uh, I do. I've got a perplex with Black Panther. So Black Panther is going to perplex up Lambda Zero's defense value. And then I think... Oh, Black Panther's here. Is that Lambda Black Zero's Panther? here. Right? Isn't Black Panther here? I, I don't know. He's heavy yeah, here. He is. So okay. he's here. <laughs> I was trying Lambda to Zero's the wrong here. 
Do you do you think you can see? I Lambda don't. Zero? I, I quite just. I'm just I curious. I'm not trying so. to. <laughs> okay. uh, Black Panther will perplex up his own defense because he doesn't have stealth, so he's gonna he's gonna need a little boost. Black Panther with no stealth. Uh, I also have. Let's thing. see. I've got a few characters that are wild card. I've got Scarlet Witch with Avengers. I've got Stardust with Power Cosmic. I think Two Gun Kid is also Avengers. So, I guess it's just my black my Black Panther has the choice of Avengers and Avengers. So he's also going to be an Avenger this turn. What a guy! Game. So the whole game from now on, I will not pick another power to copy. All right, fantastic. Thank you. Thank you, Simeon. Very cool. Is it is it now my turn, however? Now. You may go. Okay, we're going to have Kronos here just carry Batman. We're going to slap him there for no no particular particularly great reason. We're going to have Doomsday move up, and he's going to grab the heavy object as he moves. Doomsday is going to go like this. And then he's going to sit, boom, eight squares is his movement, right there on top of the telephone booth. Uh Uh-oh. Or under it, apparently. And, oh, Doomsday. Token. What a guy. And then Bat Zaro, who clocks in at 69 points. Nice. Nice. Is going to move eight squares as well, leap climb. What a guy. Uh, let's see, eight squares gets us to there, so I'll say, sure, keep that tight formation. Rocky, forgot how far Rocky can move, also eight squares, what a guy. And I'm going to pop Rocky right there, ladies and gentlemen, and that is, that is our turn, and it's All your right. go. I think I start with almost no move and attack. The only mm. person on my team with starting move and attack, of course, being the two-gun kid with his sweet hypersonic that he can have an eight attack with for two damage. Um, so I could absolutely do something with him. Uh, let's see. Eight squares out. Man, I could just, like, rock Doomsday's world with two-gun kid. Oh, I'm sure you could. I'm sure. I'm. I'm sure you could course I'd, I'd have to go like over here to get a mm. good shot mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. go like three squares that way mm-hmm. another four I get one square away um, totally live through that yeah totally Simeon totally <laughs> oh man uh, I think I think I just want to move Winter Soldier to a safer spot. We'll move him up to this square of hindering. And then, of course, he's going to pick up that heavy as he moves because he is super strong. That robot arm isn't just for show. So he's going to move up there. Black Panther is going to perplex up his defense. Uh, Not something that you used to be able to do because I think stealth worked both ways at one point. I don't know. Maybe it did. And then I will just clear my oh. people with action tokens. Uh, so I used my one perplex. Black Panther is still copying Avengers. Uh, Lambda Zero still clocking in at a big ol' zero. Mm. That's what mm-hmm. I like about mm-hmm. these huge cosmic guys. Even till the, to this day, they will still take a big cosmic, like, several hundred point piece and give them phasing top dial. To this wow. day? Yeah. To this Meanwhile, day. Hawkeye's like, I can running shot from the get go. It's like right. I gotta phase up to where I can see you. But but they're power cosmic and they can travel the spaceways. Shut up. I want them to move and shoot at the same time. I don't care. I don't care what they ignore. Don't give me none of that. Alright. Very cool. Very cool. So Winter Soldier, thanks for thanks for popping in that bush, buddy. Really appreciate it. I, I have no leadership at all. Nothing important, truly, to actually roll for at the beginning of my turn. So instead, we are going to have Batman use a ranged action. But before we do, we have Oots 
and he is going to oots to here, oh. and then use a ranged action to target six squares. Bam! Stardust. So, I love he's in 19. Shoot at David Bowie. I am going to shoot at David Bowie. Ziggy he's Stardust is not safe from Mr. Oots. With super senses. Okay, I have an 11. We need an 8, ladies and gentlemen. R... Are you ready? Are you ready for the first attack of the game? Big eights. Oh, baby. It's a 10. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I'm going to go ahead and just uh, throw a 5 down real quick. Mm. Mm. That's a, that's a uh, funny-looking 5. Oh, man. So funny-looking, it almost looks like a 4. How much damage is old Oots doing? Uh, Batman oh, go, old Oots is doing a whole 3 damage. Dang, that'll take me to click four. Um, let's see what I've mm. what I've got on click four. Ah, mm. ah. <laughs> <laughs> That's some some phasing twelve attack, pulse wave four damage, sixteen defense with regen. Ah, uh, uh. If if you didn't have a big old doomsday hiding around a corner, I sure would like to retaliate with a nice nice big old slap of pulse wave but uh, I don't know if that's well, going to happen can't, you have only 4 range so your, your slap of pulse wave sorry your slap of pulse wave oh no no I'm, I'm at 2 turns later when I phase oh, over to oh. you and then, <laughs> then pulse wave <laughs> yes yes it's the long game of mm. staying on regen really playing the long game here Simeon uh, okay what a guy. Well, actually, that was Batman, and so we have nothing to outwit, as you're the only person within six squares, I believe, that we can see. Oh, no, okay, yeah, okay. We're going to outwit. This guy's got to have something. Uh, I don't know Lambda, what is. Lambda Zero, Lambda. he's got phasing, pulse wave, super senses, the, all kinds of If powers. this was the olden days, I would probably, quite honestly, outwit his flight. But instead... I will just outwit uh, his pulse wave, even though it, it does nothing. It does quite literally nothing. Um, if this was the olden days, I could pulse wave my own team. I don't think... Yeah, it's true. <laughs> and then we're going to clear everybody else, as we don't have willpower on them, and we don't really want to... Yeah, have to deal with pushing a damage. And it is your turn. All right. Let's get Black Panther doing something. He's got a long dial. Give that... Let's see. Leap climb goes to blades. Uh, let's let's see. I can move six squares with Scarlet Witch if I carry him with that lady. Don't really want to carry him with my other guy because mm. probably want to regen. Let's go right where Scarlet Witch could get taken out in one hit. Um, uh. We'll go. Uh. Right here with Scarlet Witch, and drop my mm. Black Panther mm. down to there. Mm. Uh, mm. Sh uh, Black Panther is gonna perplex up Scarlet Witch's defense, just okay. on off chance that she survives something. Um, so that's an action for her. Definitely gonna roll my regen mm. since I. I have that one click of regen. Uh, I mean, you have three. I have three, but it's, yeah. it's one yeah. super random click. Dang. So I'll just go ahead and Darn. go back to that click one. What a, what a shame. <laughs> that 19 super senses. Well, it was fun uh, while it lasted. I think. Let's see. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to play fast and loose here. So. Lambda mm -hmm. Zero is just going to phase right up into the middle of stuff. He's really going to get in the mix. Okay. And he's going to carry the two-gun kid with him. Now, my real strategy is going to begin. Mm -hmm. Thug is going to move out of where he's at. He's going to go one, mm -hmm. two, three, four, five, six... Seven, eight. <laughs> uh, now you're all in my range. My range of four. 
Hope, okay. hope Bat Zaro is a little scared, because uh, I know uh, I am. Me am terrified. I'll have to clear uh, my Winter Soldier, because mm-hmm. I don't really want to give up stealth just mm-hmm. yet. So mm-hmm. we'll go ahead and clear him, and mm-hmm. that is all I can do this turn. Wow. Wow. Fast and loose. I like it. I like it. Very cool. So that leads us to several things. Batman is the only one with an action token. I could push Batman if I if I, if I so chose, but I like his stats. Top dial a little too much. I think we are going to be probably doing some outwits here. Batman and Bat Zaro both have outwit, which is pretty amazing. I think for sure Bat Zaro is going to go ahead and outwit the defense power Uh-oh. on uh, Lambda. Lambda Zero, Lombata. Lamba- yeah, the non-power cosmic version. Yes, uh, the, the hundred points, uh, ninety-eight point cheaper version. Yes. And let's see, who do we want to have try taking the first swings? I think it's only right and just for Don't Leslie Rocky no, Davis no. to get out of here with to go fear. ahead and, and and swing on you. So Leslie Rocky Davis will go ahead and use flurry like. Leslie Rocky Davis knows how. Okay, first attack. That's all right. That's fine. Second attack is going to be a crit hit. Do you want to prob the crit hit, Simeon? Do you want to waste your one prob uh, on your turn on the crit hit? Man. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> ha, 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 ha. Ha. Sorry for blowing out my mic. So he's doing he's doing two damage if he hits, right? damage plus knockback into the blocking terrain you utter fool we'll go ahead and uh i've got i've got energy shield so i'd block the the damage from that um Mm -hmm. we'll go ahead and prob that crit hit just to take that away from you that's what i thought that's what i thought okay all right so that's that is him but she used her prob which is what i was mostly uh mostly wanted to have happen next up uh, let me double check my line of fire for my one reroll I get in a turn. It's clear there, and it'll be blocked that way. So, sadly, we won't have a line for when Doomsday attacks, but I'm going to have Bat oh, you Zaro. Can draw, you can draw from either. Oh, that's right. I can draw square. from either square. Yeah. Right. So, I'll have line of fire to Doomsday and whatever. Cool, cool, cool. Nice. All right. We're going to have Bat Zaro go ahead and take a swing on Lambda Zero here. This is a 10 attack instead, so we only need an 8 to hit. Baby, it's a 10. It'll still do knockback into the blocking terrain. No super senses, you utter fool. Two Gosh. damage plus back. These, these mm. attack rolls, man. Mm. So he'll Ooh, go to baby. click 4, which is going to give nice. him, I believe, some energy shield. And now Doomsday. Uh, going to smack you with a heavy object. Uh, for no, he's not gonna hit you with a heavy. I don't think. Um, let's do double check it. here. No, I need a double. I already do five damage. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, okay, we we will actually hit you with the heavy object. Uh, sadly, I think we need it to push you on to click ten and kill you. So doomsday hitting you with the heavy object. Here we go. Oh my gosh! Good God! <laughs> I didn't need to use the heavy object. Darn it! All right. Well. So that's You're enough dead. to to yep. Yes. He's in the yep. dead gym. Uh Yeah, he'll he'll just uh evaporate. It's Three actions. like he was like he was never on the team. Three actions uh used up. Uh let's, let's see. I might have this guy take a shot somewhere just because he can. Um I'm thinking who, so you're gonna, you're definitely gonna shoot twice next turn with Mister Two Gun Kid. I'm gonna try. You're gonna His try. Sculpt only has one gun, but he's known as Two Gun. But he's got the fanfire, even though it's probably fanfare in the errata they say, but it's still spelt fanfire after 13 years. So we'll see. We'll see what happens. Um, and man, he has a 18 defense from range. I think we're gonna have to shoot Scarlet Witch instead with my man, my boy. Chronos. So Uh-oh. going after the witch. Before we do that, we're gonna have Batman outwit the perplex on Black Panther. Uh oh. So that'll bring Kronos, her down to what is yeah. she, uh, sixteen? We I hope. Yes. We are gonna need a seven to hit, but we still have our prob, ladies and gentlemen, which is amazing. 
and we roll an 11 anyways, which means, <laughs> guess what? I get to take an action token off of him, except I get it after resolutions. So if I would have already had a token, I'd be able to take it off, but technically I do not get to take it off now, sadly. All right, how much damage are you dealing me? Uh, he only does two, so Go you on are on. more or less Three. unaffected by it, really. Yeah, you've unlocked my barrier. I've unlocked barrier. Wow. So, wow. I'll definitely push her to use that. And then we're going to have to clear uh, the Batman <clears throat> in the deep dark lair of the Batman. All right. So I left my Winter Soldier open for this super sweet shot here. Um, mm. Totally could have positioned him. No, in a the different shot. Was, way. The shot was definitely for Rocky, as you could see. He made you use your prop, which was really yeah. the most important. Man, these rolls insane. So, like, sure we had like we had a four and a five, right? But a crit hit, a ten, a, another crit hit, and an eleven. Nothing under a ten besides these this four and five roll. Like that's insane. This slew of rolls was crazy. So, Winter Soldier is going to go ahead and. Uh... Use ranged combat expert both into attack. He's going to take out Ivan Drago's competition okay. and uh, blast Rocky out of there. <laughs> See what you did there. <laughs> See what you. No, that's funny. That no, that's quite great. clever. That's great. Yeah, because he was a. And Leslie. Soviet Leslie Rocky Davis else. goes down. It's a whole 10 points for Team Simeon. That's. Hey, baby. We're, we're coming back, only 65 to go. Uh, Two Gun Kid is gonna go ahead and for like for for this one turn, I think I've got. I want to get rid of that outwit. Um, mm. I do have enough range to get to your prob as well, but I've only got the mm. two damage. So we'll go ahead and do that. I'm gonna read off his power again. Uh, give him a ranged combat action. He makes two separate ranged attack combat attacks as free actions, making two separate attack rolls against two po target opposing characters. Resolve the first attack before making the second. So we'll go ahead and aim for your prob first. Okay. Your roll, your roll roll after Kronos. Kronos. So I've got a 10. Shooting for... A 16. Your 16. Well, can you see, can you see this back square? You cannot. No. You can only see the front square, so I will have 17 because of the hindering terrain. Oh, no. Man. We'll we'll do it. I believe in the two-gun kid. Mm. Um, well, it has to be a separate character for the second one. So we're going <laughs> to go after uh, good old Batman up there next to my Black Panther. Ah, yes, but can you see through... Oh, Stone. also hindering. <laughs> oh, right. Bat Zaro it is. <laughs> but Don't. can you see through being 69? <laughs> Don't you dare. Nice. Okay. Okay. No, he does have ESD, ah. though, so he, he is an 18. <laughs> well, a 13 won't do it, so. Oh, no, no, it sadly will not. And you outwitted my prob and my perplex, I believe, that turn, right? I did not. You have a prob. Oh, I do have a prob. Yes, well, I could not see your prob at the time of the outwits okay. with Batzar. I outwitted the defense power on Lambda Zero. Oh, that's right. I will prob that second attack. That was a Good 17 miss. hit. Okay. Well, Thank goodness. well, you know. Well. One, two, three, four, five, six. I think. So that's two actions. Yeah, that's ten squares. Huh. We're gonna go ahead and uh, hmm. Hmm. go ahead and move hmm. Lambda Zero 2.0, oh. also known as Ziggy Stardust, up to this okay. hindering up here. Okay. Um, and then Black Panther is gonna use his super cool 11 attack, no special attack power, and uh, no perplex. He's just gonna punch Batman with his 11. And really hope he does something. Literally anything. Help me out, roll 20. It's an 18 hit Batman. It does, and so Kronos will prob it. Ooh. Does a 16 hit Batman? <laughs> Batman has a 17 defense, ladies and gentlemen. Dang. For those 
keeping track at home. And then we will go ahead and clear the Scarlet Witch. And uh, mm. don't forget about Mr. Thug down in the corner. He's also I'll, clear. I'll try my best not to forget about him. I actually thought about pushing him to shoot at... Uh, to shoot at, uh, I don't know, Rocky. That, whatever. Oh, Rocky? Is. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was like, oh, that'd be fun. Push him to death just to kill Rocky. But hmm. uh, Winter Soldier had the shot. Right. Of course. We're going to use Bat Zaro's outwit to outwit Scarlet Witch's prob. We'll use Batman's outwit to outwit Black Panther's perplex. And then let's go ahead. And I'm pretty sure we're going to swing with Batty Boy. Because uh, he is our, obviously our, our only open. I just don't know if I want to oots him anywhere. Because uh, I do need a line of fire to the ooting. Um, it has to be within six. So that's the only square I could oot to. And I don't really want to, because from there, I can't really shoot anybody except for Thug. And yeah, so I think he's just going to stay there. No ooting this turn. He's just going to go ahead and punch Black Panther. 11 to your defense for 3 damage. Ooh, does a, four, does a 14 hit? Black Panther surprisingly has a 17 toughness, mm -mm. so he will We're going to... We're going to feel obliged to prob that with our good friend, timekeeper, human stopwatch, Kronos. Does a uh, 20 hit? Actually, no. So he has a 21 ah, defense. I... <laughs> uh, just like the new Galactus, he's a rocket of 21. But how many um, grids of blood does uh, he have? He will take two grids of blood because of toughness, of reducing your... Of course. Was there was there a special damage thing that he they said? I don't remember what they called the damage. I, don't, I think it was yeah, called death or something. So he'll go to to grid blood of three. Should not have wasted our outwit on your perplex. Realizing this, uh, hindsight being twenty twenty, of course. But grid of blood number three, very solid, very solid. All right. Let's go ahead and just, yeah, like I said, I cleared everybody else, as you can see. So that is that is it. That is the turn. So take us away, Simeon. Right. Two-Gun Kid is absolutely going to push this turn. He's still got a 10 attack for two. He's going to take a crack shot at Kronos first. See if I can even the odds by getting rid of your prob while keeping my own for a little bit. So 10 for two on your 17 because it's still yes. in green. Mm. Kronos is going to have to prob that. Ooh, a crit hit, you say. Ooh, uh, ooh. Half. I'll, I'll prob that with Scarlet Witch, just because I really want Oh, uh, but she doesn't have any probability control. Oh. But that second attack can <laughs> be against that so, Zaro. So yeah, I have to, I have to change targets. Um, one Batman's in stealth, so the only other one I can see is that bottom Batman. Uh, does an 18 which, hit him? Which will hit that Zaro, yes. Okay. And I'll take him to click three. Deal him two damage. and He does still have outwit, mm. I think. Uh, click three, yes. Yes. What's his? What's Bat Zaro's defense? Uh, his defense is a 14 now with energy shield deflection. So his clicks are all the same. Uh, they're 50-50. So his top dial is Leap Climb with Smoke Cloud, with ESD, and Outwit. And then his second click is Stealth, Energy Explosion, Willpower, with his special Useless Belt, Negative Perplex. And they just alternate like that, his whole uh -huh. dial. Yes. Well, we're going to go ahead and shoot him with a thug. Mm, okay. I, don't know if, I, don't I do know have if, a whole 16 from range. I don't know if Bizarro, Martha, and uh, the other Thomas Wayne, <laughs> Bizarro, Thomas Wayne... <laughs> We're also taken out by a thug, but we're gonna try and take uh, out Bizarro Batman with the thug. They were actually taken about uh, by Joe Joe Warm <laughs> instead of uh, <laughs> Billy Warm instead of Joe. Billy Warm, warm. yeah, Billy uh, Warm. All right, Bat <laughs> Batzaro wow. is definitely getting blasted Absolutely by the thugs. Getting... One damage. Ouch! Moving to click four, Batzaro. And then on click three, does. Scarlet Witch have anything I can really use? Not a terrible attacker on click one. On click three, she's still an eight for two with eight range. Um, she will actually take a shot at Kronos. Mm. Just 
for the heck of it. Does a 15 hit? A 15 does not uh, hit. It's... Uh, I knew it uh. didn't, but I still wanted it to. And then, well, let's let's double check if I want to push Black Panther when he's on click three. Uh, sometimes there's some cool stuff going on. Oh, Black Panther has outwit right now on click three. So I could have gotten rid of something to have a prop. He also has blades. Uh, what is? I can't see that Batman anyhow. You cannot. Uh, and but Bat I do have Zaro, toughness to answer your question. You didn't ask. Batzaro. Do, did have outwit, but now he doesn't. He now has the negative perplex special, which is his special speed power that's on his damage slot. He has willpower, energy explosion, and stealth. Okay, I will get rid of Batzaro's negative perplex power. Okay. Um, I don't know if I quite want to push off of my outwit and blades. What is that Batman's defense? It is a seventeen. 17. I will do it. Just just mm. cuz I, I only need a 7 and it's blades. Spicy. So I can always I can always trust my blades rolls. Mhm. Mm ooh. Just got, ooh. A, just got a hit. Wow. Just real real good. Wow. 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 What else do you want me to say besides <laughs> wow? I don't understand. <laughs> does does Kronos he, he already used his prop for the two gun? Guns, I already that used right? my prop. Oh, yeah, right. yeah, yeah, yeah. So let's yeah. let's see what what damage plus one. Ah, <laughs> two damage. Batman, Batman goes to click two. <laughs> that'll very sad. I'm sorry, Simon. Sorry for your loss. That'll push uh, Black Panther to click four. <laughs> they. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so worth it, though. So worth it. Mm, uh, it though. And <laughs> Batman does still have outwit, so you don't have perplex still. Yeah, because it was bat outwit. Yeah, yeah. The Most crit hits in this game. Wow. Are and we up to three crit hits so far? Two have landed. I'm insane. In yeah. Insane in the membrane right now. <sighs> Wild. Wild. All right. So let's go ahead. Do some, do some fun, fun moving around type deal type stuff. Uh, you're gonna click four. You probably have what toughness to outweigh I imagine Black Panther. Black Panther is perplex and super senses with the 16 defense. Okay, what is Scarlet Witch's defense right now? I believe it's a 15 with barrier. Mm. We are gonna have. Batman out with the super senses, and we're gonna have Bat Zaro use his useless utility belt uh, to not perplex anything because it is. Uh, is it outweighted anymore? Or nope. No, uh, I pushed Actually. off out. Okay, so. so we're gonna use Bat Zaro's useless utility belt to perplex down Scarlet Witch's defense, and he's gonna use energy explosion uh -oh. targeting Scarlet Witch. Yeah, and that'll hit a thirteen. A thirteen, I think. <laughs> I'll let it stand. Uh, which uh, I will prob it with Kronos, though, because I do want to do this. I think it'd be really cool. Yes, that is much better. Hmm. And because I want you to waste your prob on yeah. Bad Zar. I'll go, I'll go ahead and... I don't want to take awesome. four damage split between two characters. Huzzah. So that will instead hit a... Ooh, 15? a 15. A 15 will so hit, yes. That will hit Scarlet Missing. Witch. It'll miss Black Panther. Missing Black Panther, yes. Uh, that'll take Scarlet Witch to click five. Also known as the... Which is... No longer worth any points click. Yes. Fantastic. Good job, Batzaro. A real pat on the back, I must say. Let's go ahead and see what I want to do with Doomsday. Um, the people I would like to base Doomsday next to, I kind of don't want to base to be honest with you um so i'm very curious about what i want to do although this range combat expert gentleman is maybe too dangerous to be left alive i don't know what you're talking I mean, about I mean, he has square done reach. nothing except taking out a yeah a boxer 
Very true. Mm. Or no, that was Philadelphia. I'm sorry. Yes. I'm sorry to all the Philadelphia people. I don't know why I said Brooklyn. Southpaw. Uh, all right. Well, you have a 19 defense. I need to roll a 10 or higher with no prob on this guy to keep him uh, at least somewhat safe. Or I can use hypersonic speed with a negative 2 attack value to just get away from you. Which I think might be my choice. Because he is a flight with the weird white circle around the whatever, which means the flight transporter. So I'm going to use hypersonic speed with this guy, with good old Kronos. So not a one would be great. Fantastic. Oof, I wish. Fantastic. So what is Kronos' speed value? Being a nine, all right. Uh, I would like to hypersonic to one, two, three, four, five, six. Mm. We're going to hypersonic to here. Uh oh. And we're going to shoot the Scarlet Witch. Hmm. Not liking that. She's got a 14. Baby. <laughs> Even with negative two, that would have hit. A 19 defense, which would have actually hit this guy, oddly enough. Well, very, very waste, cool. You super wasted it on a 14. I did. I did. But, I really uh, did. Man, bummed about that, I must say. Can't really, can't really count on your rolls this game. I mean, mm. that's only the second 11, and that's only the, the seventh... In the game we have, Prob, it's very weird. The uh, insane amount of whatever we've been on. And then picking up the phone booth, Doomsday is going to leap and climb over to here. Uh Uh-oh. And we'll clear Batman. And it's your go. Uh Uh-oh. Yes. Uh Uh-oh. Let's see. (laughs) I really don't want to take on Doomsday with Winter Soldier. That seems silly. But I do have super strength, so let's go ahead and go 10 into whatever his defense is for a possible 5 damage if I hit. Yeah. Ooh. 17? Uh, no. Okay. It's a 19. Thank goodness. Well, that, that object's gone. Uh, let's see. Can I see over outdoor blocking? On elevated, elevated two, I don't, I don't remember. I don't think you can. Just now, to, I'm gonna say that I might be wrong, but I really, safe. yeah, I, yeah, it's been a while. I know there's yeah. like they, they went back and forth back in like they 2007, did. 2018. So it's kind of a, a weird place right now. Um, I don't, I don't think you said you were gonna outwit my perplex that turn. So because. <laughs> I think you have outwit right now. No, I have. I still have perplex. I believe. Oh, do you? Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm still on click four. So. Oh, okay, I, I gotcha. I off my outwit clicks onto perplex. Um, All right. Mister Stardust is going to try and psychic blast Kronos. I think it's only fitting Oof. that a Oof. a shiny spaceman shoot at another kind of spaceman. Uh, okay. A a ten for three if I hit. Hmm. That will, if you have a, whatever, 10 attack, at least 17, whatever, a 16 will hit. Yes, that absolutely hits. You are also a square out of my range, like a genius <laughs> that I was. So I will roll for super senses and hope it sticks. It doesn't for three damage. Three damage. So I go to click four on Mr. Os. Cronios. I really can't do a whole lot more, so I'm going to have to clear... The two gun kid, and sadly, he is on his timeline manipulation where he can only prob attack rolls targeting himself or ones uh, that he makes. So his own attack rolls and ones that target himself. Sadly, uh, sadly, yep, that's where we're at with old Chronos here. It's a little bit better than a little bit better for me. I can. I can it is play better around for you. that. Yeah, yeah. No, absolutely. We are going to do what? Let's see. First of all, 
Batman doesn't like Black Panther. It's not a personal thing. It's just like you're very similar characters. He feels like you're kind of stealing his whole I'm the shadow, I'm the night, blending in type deal. Batman's very uppity about the his dead. gimmicks. What are you talking it's about? King of the Dead. Oh, you're going Batman's back. Batman's never Batman. owned okay. a, an entire nation. This is I guess what we're doing. He doesn't this take what we're doing. This is what we're doing yeah, right now. Okay. Wakanda. We are going to have the Bat Zaro make some attacks here. Uh, we are going to have him. I think Thug should have cleared that turn, actually. Thug oh. has, a, has a token here. He definitely that's, should be cleared. Everybody true. else is blue. Yeah. We're going to have Bat Zaro go ahead and shoot the two gun kid after we perplex down his. Let's see. What's two gun kid's defense again? It's something with ESD. Two gun kid is currently at. It's nothing super fancy. It's a 15 ESD right now. Okay. So we would need. Uh, it'd be down to a 16, and we would need an 8 to hit. Two, an 8 to hit two gun kicks. We have an 8 attack. What is Black Panther's defense at right now? Black Panther is on click 4, so he has okay. super senses and I think a 16. Yes. Ah, I like that a lot more. We'll, we'll perplex down his defense, and then Batman will outwit his defense. No more super senses. Batman will then give himself a close combat action, and oots over to here. Uh-oh. And he's going to punch Mr. Stardust. Uh-oh. Ooh, ah. Uh. Oh, baby, that definitely misses. Uh, hits a 16, so it doesn't. A.K.A. no, no, it doesn't. And then we're going to have Bat Batman Zorro. already tried this, and I, I healed right back up. So. That's, that's true. That is true. <laughs> Though, if you had done that, that would have been... Really fun. Uh, could, that would have been. I could have pulled that that Batman for four next turn. <laughs> and then we're let's go ahead and have Bat Zaro go ahead and shoot Black Panther here. An eight to your fifteen energy explosion. Well, do I have a three damage? I imagine there's no way I have more than a one or two if I have energy explosion. I have two damage. I always have two damage. Fantastic. Whatever. Energy explosion. What are you doing? I was trying to see if I was in hindering. Oh, oh okay. I was like, oh, he's trying to move this guy. All right. Roll it up. <laughs> Fat Zaro misses, hits a twelve. Not a good, not a good time for our attack rolls, sadly. And I will feel so inclined to clear Mr. Kronos and <laughs> Doomsday. All right. Not feeling I'm not feeling so bad. Um mm. I should, but I'm not. Uh the two gun kid, since he is still standing, and he still has his two guns. Uh, he's probably hated like everything about that sentence. Um, he's gonna he's gonna take a pot shot at Bat Zaro. So we're gonna go my nine attack. First shooting at Bat Zaro, and then let's see who else. Uh, you I need you need an entire five to hit. Is that Batman up on elevated? Is he in hindering? Yeah, he has. To oh baby, hindering. oh baby, he is. Yeah, he has to be. Okay. Um, and I can't do any damage to Doomsday, so... Definitely, yeah. So first attack will be at Bad Zaro. All right. Second's going to have to be at Kronos. Let's see what I can do. Definitely hitting or, Bad no, Zaro. No, 16. 16, yeah. Moving Bad Zaro to click six. And then he will take a pot shot at Kronos, and you'll be able to prob this one. I will, I will. It's targeting you. Mm. Ooh, and you'll need to, because it's a 14... Um, is, uh, 12. Mm, no, actually, my defense is exactly a 14. <laughs> is it? Uh, yeah. <laughs> so we will prob it to see if it misses. Oh, man. Hopefully, I, hopefully yes. I hope it... Oh, oh baby! I, I was going to say, there's no way it can, right? There's no way <laughs> Roll20 would do me dirty like that. Uh, but uh, um, uh, The space Kronos, dice always hurt me like that. Kronos. All right, what's Bat Zaro's wow. defense? A Bat Zaro yeah, actually has his defenses went up. Believe it or not, it's a sixteen now for Bat Zaro. All right, we're gonna try and shoot. After him all, with... I am paying sixty nine points for him. Nice. <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna shoot him with the thug. Okay. I need a seven. Oh no! That'll do one damage. No, taking thug. out Bat Zaro. <laughs> sadly, on his last oh, man. click. Should have got rid of that thug sooner. Man. Johnny Warm does it again to the Bat Zaro family. Um, 
<laughs> All right. So my Black Panther, he's hurting. He's on click uh, four. So he has perplex back. Mm -hmm. uh, what is what is this Batman up here? What's his what's his thing? What's he doing with his defense? Yeah, combat reflexes. Combat reflexes. The sixteen. The sixteen. Yes. Black Panther definitely doesn't have any range. Um. So an eighteen. I've got an eleven attack with Mister Stardust. Uh, I'm gonna boost his attack up to a twelve with Black mm. Panther because weird how you think you have an 11 attack uh, on top dial does he not oh it's a is it's a 10 pen -sai, that's right 10 oh you know what though i will boost yeah up see, his then, you, damage. then you looked at the <laughs> dial and i'm like dang this sucks <laughs> i will boost up my own damage to a uh, uh four yeah. so that i can use close combat expert darn darn if we know anything really, guys david bowie between drinking milk and eating uh peppers he was a really good close combat expert. So, uh, 12 into your 18. Yes, you need a 6. Sadly, that hits for 4 damage and takes Batman to click uh, 6. Ooh. Uh, no more ooting on click 6, by the way. All there out shall be no more ooting. And I think that this... I know... Happens to the best of us. I know that this uh, Black Panther definitely never gets stealth. It's a full dial of leap climb but i really wish i think i'm still gonna move him into hindering just because uh -huh. he'll go he'll go one square over into hindering one jeez just just to get okay. that slight bonus to my that defense. one entire square over yeah i've got the actions for it that's <laughs> four it's i could fine. still do something with a uh, winter soldier you could um i'd have you to hit push Doomsday him again Push, 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 push. Hmm. If you push, you get willpower. I do get willpower. Yeah, yeah. Which is probably better than toughness, because if you hit me, you're hitting me for five, which will take me to click five, and that's no good. So I'm going to go ahead and try and push to break away. Yes, 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 yes. No, no, no. <laughs> Need a four, <laughs> five, six. Ooh, There's you a got four. It. Mm. Uh, so I'm going to just skedaddle one, two, three, four squares because I respect skedaddle. coming out of hindering. So mm. that'll push me to click two. Okay. Uh, nothing great going on that click. That's a whole five actions, I think, for the first time of this game that I've taken. And so two characters down. Finally, using five actions. Hmm. hmm. How neat is that? That's pretty neat. Oh, I suppose we are going to go ahead and. But hmm. What do you? Uh, yeah, I got stealth. I need you. I need <laughs> you to cut that out. I need you to cut, quit doing that. I think my thug wants to hurt another Batman. <laughs> His first bats are. I mean, he's got to move. Quite a ways. Uh, but, uh, yeah. We are going to have <laughs> Kronos try to incapaci incapacitate the two gun kid. My whole eight attack to your. 17. Yeah, 17, energy, well, baby. 15 with energy shield, but. Wow, that hits a 16. A great roll. Whew. Any other universe. But here, not so much. He can't prop his own attacks, though. Oh, I can't prop my own attacks. Thank you. Does he Thank still you very have much. That? We need. Yeah, I do still have that. We need a nine. Wow, two amazing rolls, by the way. <laughs> but okay. And you flip Fine. the dice. That's pretty nice. Yeah, that is pretty. That's quite clever. And then we're going to leap climb with Doomsday. Wow. Actually, he's going to move here. I don't I don't much care for two-gun kid, even if he probably can't damage me. Um, yeah. And then the Batman will clear and that is the whole turn that's our turn ladies and gents all right two gun kid rocking still rocking a two damage with his nine attack i don't see any reason not to push him to click three uh he does not get worse 
he only gets slightly better. Um, Black Panther. In the slightest sense. I mean, really, in the slightest sense. I mean, the problem is I can't really do my double attack because I only have one person I can target. One dude, yeah. Yeah. And you sadly can't shoot him twice. What I can do is use Perplex. Uh, what's what's Doomsday's attack value? Uh, it is a nine. Ah, a nine. I will, I will go ahead and perplex that down Ouch. to an eight. Hurtful. Um, Hurtful. Let's see. I lost my blades, so there's no blades in Doomsday. Uh, we're just gonna have the two gun kid go ahead and give it his all and take a shot at Kronos. Uh, what's Kronos's defense? You know, it's a 14. It's a whole 14. I don't think I want to take a minus 2, so I'm just going to stand right it is, here. It's a whole 14, baby. I need a With super senses, though. I need a 5 twice. You, yes. We have to prob that. The crit hits in this game. Wow. I'd like it wow. to stick. So that we we need to start playing on sense. Tuesdays instead of Wednesdays. The All right, we have to roll super senses. Wow, look at that, ladies Dang. and gentlemen. That cr the crit hits, four crit hits in this game so far. Or at least turning up on the dice. Three of stuck. This is insane. This is wild to me. <laughs> wow. We're almost out of props, too. If only... We are, yeah. If only I could kill Kronos. Uh, so far, no crit and... misses, and that is what's really worrying me. The cosmic balance is completely offset. Oh, yeah, yeah. Crit miss. I didn't want to say it. I didn't want to bring it up. Ugh. It's got to switch weird. back at some point. Yes. Just, I mean, there have been some threes and uh, some fours, so there have been some that is close yeah. enough for me to a crit miss. Uh, <laughs> sadly, I will have to clear everyone, including the thug. Mm. He's not going to push himself mm. when mm. when Doomsday isn't even in his range yet. That's right. Oh. <laughs> Batman is going to flurry on Stardust here, hoping we can hit a crit hit, maybe a couple of times. I, I really... You didn't. Oh, first Flurry. Uh, I have a 10 attack, so that will miss. I do need a 9 at least to hit Stardust. He has a incredibly high defense, and that one will also miss, sadly, for Batman. For the Batman. Man. Bat. Batman. That's rough. That's real rough. I was really hoping that bad boy would stick. <laughs> it doesn't. I think we're going to have to say goodbye to Oots, Oots Magoots Batman here in a little bit. Doomsday doesn't really want to push himself. He doesn't honestly want to get rid of his 19 defense. He really digs it. He really likes it. So Doomsday and Kronos are going to go ahead and take a rest. And by that, I mean clear. First things first. This thug can move a whole four squares. So, I can get it up. Like, if I, if I go right here, I can see that back square. I can, I can see, uh, I, I can see that back square if I move there. Um, can't see a whole lot of, so we'll go ahead and, we'll go ahead and plop the thug right there. Why, why could you only move four? Uh, I'm moving out of hindering. He was in a square. But you're here, there. weren't you? I thought you were. Was I? Oh, oh, it's the. So I was looking at the top of his card is green, and I definitely thought that was like oh the gosh. hindering clipping from behind him. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, let's see. So you have <laughs> so you have eight speed, Simeon. Let's go ahead and re rethink this, Doug. Uh, Once again, you were in this square. You weren't in this one. You were in this one. You were here. Just saying. Just saying, man. I think this thug wants to go up and beat on Batman, so he's gonna. Are you? I can't believe you done this. He's gonna. Yeah, he's gonna move up there instead. Wow. Wow. Just in case, in like two turns, you haven't defeated the thug. Uh, he's coming for you. What is Batman's oh. defense right now? It is a 15, combat reflexes. Ooh, so I need a 7 for close. I don't have a lot of range going on because Winter Soldier has to break away for that. I think it's worth trying, though, because I've got a 
and if he breaks away, he's got a 10 attack, and he only needs a 5. So I'm going to try and break away running shot with the Winter Soldier. I'm going to roll 1d6, because that seems fair. Mm. Ah, a 2. Seems fair to me. He's going to just uh, go ahead and take a squat right there. Mm. Just pop a, pop a squat. He's not super <laughs> worried about Doomsday yeah. now. Uh, Black Panther does have Perplex. He does have a 10 attack for 2. Doomsday's rocking. What's his defense power? Uh, invulnerability. So that's not going to happen. Uh, yeah, we'll just... We'll just uh, We'll boost my man Stardust here. Hmm. Uh, let's see. Batman's got combat reflexes. Uh, we'll go ahead and boost his damage again. He's mm. going to go ahead and use close mm. combat expert. Mm. And he'll he'll give himself a 12 mm. attack. Can, can we four. get a crit miss, ladies and gentlemen? I hope not. But Very we close. can get something real low. Wow. A, f a 15 does miss. Okay. A 15 does miss. And Thank Black goodness for Panther, combat reflexes. Black Panther will attempt to break away. We're going to leave Winter Soldier to die by himself. So I've got a plus two because wow. I've got Leap Climb. Wow. Okay. That'll that'll do it for me. Um, it will. It will. I think, man, I, I still want to be within perplex range of my own guys so I'm gonna just move him up to here where I can see everyone I want to see mm. but no one can see me and two gun kid is gonna go ahead and reload his gun <laughs> Jesus okay yeah alright alright okay sure sure let's go ahead I honestly think Doomsday being next Winter Soldier is pretty dumb. Pretty dumb for Doomsday. But before we make such a decision about whether or not we want to move Doomsday, I think Kronos needs to take a shot. Sadly, uh, he needs a 9 to hit either Winter Soldier or the Two-Gun Kid, which I must say is a darn shame. So Doomsday is first up. Going to try to go for the crazy 8 attack that we need since we rolled two 8s last time. With uh, Mr. Kronos, we're going to try to roll some 8s this time with Doomsday and just annihilate the Winter Soldier. If we can get lucky, oh, and we can, for for 6 damage Dang. using the telephone booth. So he's on click 2, so that's going to do 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, uh, let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, uh, 6, so I'm still alive. <laughs> <laughs> ah, shame. Uh, no, Darn shame, I must say. That's not how counting goes. No, all right, hey, good. Yeah. Fantastic. Just enough. And and Kronos, uh, he could incapacitate, or he could shoot you for one damage. I think he's going to incapacitate the two-gun kid. And we'll see what we can do with that. It is a whole eight attack, tier 17. We would need that 11 again, which would... <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> ha! Ha! For one action token, it's what you're... One, Finally, one action token. the two-gun kid has line of fire to Doomsday. Yes. But I've lost my perplex. Alas. But alas. Um, and Batman is, you know... I, no, he, I haven't lost my perplex. It's Batman sure does love all this. And he does... You know, I think Batman is going to die. I really, truly do. In the my bottom of hearts, I think Batman is probably going to die next turn. So Batman is going to push to Flurry... Uh oh. First attack, targeting the thug. No! Because how dare he? Uh, that will hit the thug. Very glad we used that on the thug. If I rolled, would have rolled a crit hit, I would be very mad at myself. Um, especially. So we kill the thug, and now we need a 9 to damage Mr. Stardust. And it is another 8. And Batman will go to click 7. Hmm. And it is your go. It is your turn. Simi well, Embers. Well, let's see. Well, the two gun kid is on his special speed power, which gives him a plus two to speed if he's not carrying anybody. Yes. So he could, at this moment, push to hypersonic with a nine speed, thus killing the Batman. 
Oh, wow. I don't know if I can actually get there. Actually. Can you fly? No, no, no. This is a walkie speed thing. I figured. Uh, yeah. Uh, so let's... Yeah, let's... Let's see. If I go... If I go here... That's eight. Yeah, I can't get up there. Nope. No. Hmm. Well. Black Panther Sad. can perplex his range up to one. Uh, no, that's not a thing. And other uh, things, Black, you cannot do. <laughs> we'll go ahead and perplex... Let's go ahead and perplex... Uh, I don't really have to worry about your guys if I kill Batman. And I don't have not to worry really, about your guys no, even if really I don't kill Batman. You. Yeah. So we'll just boost uh, Ziggy Stardust's... Uh, attack to an 11 and then he'll mm -hmm. use close combat expert to bump it to a 13 yes Hope so i don't crit miss yes that is the only way you could possibly miss batman at this point in time that will hit and kill no 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 the batman very good Ooh, Ooh ah. so we both have two real big hitters left at top uh, dial both of the 19 defense. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I feel like yours is a, a bit worse to deal with, but uh, I don't... I can't do anything with the two-gun kid to damage him. I don't know if I want to push... Whoa. See, the two-gun kid is on click three, I believe. I pushed him once already. Um, man, oh man. What is the defense on Kronos right now? It is still a 14 with Super Senses. I'm just going to hope you don't hit Super Senses, and I'm going to push him to take a shot at you. All right. Going to click four will not hurt me that much, because uh, Doomsday will hit me either way if he hit, decides to do that. So two-gun kid on Kronos, nine attack. Ooh, that'll do it. We'll have to prob it with Kronos using a special Kronos prob. Chronos prob. All right, not Thanks. a crit hit, so exact we do get a thing. roll. Our super senses, which does fail for how much? Two whole damage. Takes me to click six. Am I still alive on click six? Chronos is alive, if not just barely holding on on click six. I'm trading. I'm trading one click for two. And I don't know if that's a good strategy, but it's what I'm doing. So that'll be it for my turn. Uh, Good old Black Panther up here will clear. Still Good old rocking, Black Panther. Rocking the uh, copied Avengers team ability. So if <laughs> he needs that plus one to speed. He's got it. Uh, okay. What a guy. Uh, my turn's going to be super simple, super easy, and we're going to clear everyone on my team. All right. I'm going to push the two-gun kid again. <laughs> Except, yeah... Uh, you we'll just, will try. Let's see. Do we have? We've got minimum six range, uh, just to potentially stave off the inevitable. Black Panther will move to this square, and he will perplex up the two-gun okay. kid's defense by one. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, it's a whole six. So we'll we'll do that, and we'll see what happens. Two-gun kid might have another. Another round left in his barrel. Whatever. <laughs> Another. I mean, that it's works, right? It's a round. A, a yeah, round in a, a, yeah, it's a round. I get it. No, I get it. A, a round, round in the funny. chamber is a more likely go. thing to say. I yes. Guess. You wouldn't really put a round straight into the barrel. But no. Semantics. Good job, Simeon. You are... You're, unless it's like a musket where it has to go, which we obviously know it isn't. Uh, it's some weird other oh, yeah. gun thing. You're shooting twice, um, so if it's a musket, it's a double barrel musket. It's quick. It's don't exist. I don't think. Like, don't if it does exist. Don't <laughs> comment. Just <laughs> all right. Uh, Kronos. You know he actually has steel energy. Um, but I kind of don't want to want to base you. <laughs> Do it. Because Kronos kind of also has... Oh, a 16 defense. It's actually went up. Okay. You know? I think Kronos is going to go ahead and pop a squat right there. Just right... Yeah, just right there. 
And then, what's old Ziggy Stardust's range? He's got a big old eight. Not as good as Winter eight, Soldier, huh? but yeah, it's still pretty good. Wow, that's eighteen. Wow, <laughs> <laughs> give me a second. There, there wow, we go. that's an eight. Wow, <laughs> we're gonna. I'm gonna go ahead and have good old Doomsday. He's gonna go leaping and climbing. Leaping and climbing. Hmm. 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 Okay. Gonna go down there, grab the object, end the movement here. Doomsday holding that sweet, sweet, heavy, heavy object. And it is your turn. Yep. All right. I think it is time to end Kronos' reign of terror. Um, no, not Kronos. I cannot believe you've done this. So you said he's got a 16, right? He does have a 16 defense, baby. I'm, I'm assuming that 3 damage might do it. Potentially. Yeah, you I know. feel like I've hit him a few times, so maybe. not for a lot. But I'm, I'm feeling like 3 damage might do it. I'm going to go maybe. ahead and just... Just leave things as they are, and okay. go ahead and use use Ziggy Stardust to, to shoot right. ten into a sixteen, hoping I get a six. Hmm. That so is, you were hoping that is why you were perplex hoping. Is, or is if you around, would have perplexed so. your attack, yeah. I, and I was um, going it or not, to, but uh, were you? I thought giving the two gun kid three damage would have been a better option, which would've we're still we're real... still gonna do. So okay, so uh, good old Ziggy Stardust will take an action here. Uh, okay. Black Panther will perplex up two gun kids damage by one. His damage. I cannot His do damage? a range attack, or can I? Do I have the sharpshooter? Nope. Don't know if that was even a thing yet. Uh, so he's got a nine. He needs mm -hmm. a bit higher than what I just rolled. Just a, a seven. So we will feel inclined to prob that, as Kronos is still the manipulator of the timeline. Ooh. Ooh. Will a 16 hit? A 16 is the golden ticket, Charlie, and your chocolate factory to take out old Kronos. And no, his more, no more super senses, does he? Okay. Nope, no more super sensitive. It was it was <clears throat> just a sixteen. So that was not a range combat action, so I cannot do no. a second attack. Uh, sadly, no. which is what I was gonna go for. Hoping which is why to I don't know why you could twice your damage when you could have well, used your attack. So well, I mean it didn't end up mattering, you know, but I mean in the off chance like when you roll five, just I to thought, bring I it thought if I if I hit with Kronos yeah. or if I hit Kronos yeah. with a... Ziggy right, Stardust here. Ziggy Stardust. Then I got it. No, I understood. Kid could possibly do damage. But, Pop uh, Doomsday. <laughs> yeah, just mm. absolutely destroy Doomsday. Yeah, uh, Black Panther will have to clear, huh? and we'll have to really hope that something better happens. Yeah, uh, Doomsday, Doomsday is still top dial. <laughs> yeah, he is, baby, and Doomsday will clear. He likes staying top dial. He doesn't like pushing at all. Man. So he's gonna be there. Stardust yep. does get. He does get pulse wave mm. on click four, but you're gonna hit me way past that if you do hit me. So that's plan. Uh man, and good old two gun kid. He's been real good to me. Uh, he's been a good kid. I've been pushing him a lot. I've been really forcing him into some lines of work that he doesn't want to be in. Some rough but, situations. Uh, he's still got two damage. I think I'm gonna. He's on click four. I think I'm going to go ahead and perplex up his damage and push him one more time just to wow. see if he's got what it takes. He's got a nine attack. I need something good. Probably won't get it. That's an 18. It's one off, isn't it? It misses by one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh. So sad. It, they'll, they'll take so a sad. five. That's so fine. Sad. That's fine. So sad. So sad. And, uh... I think Black Panther likes where he's at, so he's just going to keep chilling there. Chilling? I like will, the villain? I will actually, yeah, I will uh, I will clear 
Ziggy Stardust for this turn. Mm. Okay. All right. I've got to make some interesting choices. I've got one guy. No willpower. Just one dude against the world. Now, he's beefy, yes. Um, but... And does he have a high defense? Yes, also correct. Yes. Hmm. Or, because I quite literally have leap climb, duh. Um, hmm. But does that, that, does that give you a good amount of turns to swing on me with both a Black Panther and a Ziggy Stardust? It's really that close combat expert is really a threat. It truly is. Uh, like, like no other. So. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's tough. And still having the perplex is very solid. Very solid. Actually, Black Panther, I really should have, you know, took him out more. I should have took him out. I really should have. Uh, leaving him around was a little rough. But your prob was big. Um, honestly, this guy was just in the way. The Lombada dude. So I don't know if I want to waste a turn, you know, moving here or whatever. Or if I should just get up in the thick of it. And I think we're just going to get up in the thick of it and see what happens. We're going to let oh. dice be rolled. We're just going to, yeah. 19 yeah. vulnerability. 19 Coming vulnerability. The fray. I, don't know if, I don't know if Black Panther can actually damage him right now. I'm pretty sure he's got some twos going on most of his dial. Uh, yeah, solid twos his whole dial. So twos, baby. Complex up Black Panther's defense. Uh, does Doomsday drop to a toughness at any point? Uh, I honestly don't think he does. Let me check. Doomsday uh, always has to reduce her by two, whether in yeah. vulnerability or impervious. All right, so do 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 do. I, do. I just really want this this first attack to hit. Then, uh, so he's got a nineteen. I've got a ten. I'm gonna go ahead and perplex up. Ziggy Stardust damn or attack to an eleven. Actually, you know what? We'll perplex up his damage to a four, and then he'll use close combat expert to bump it up to a twelve. So I need a right. seven. That's a that's an average roll. That roll twenty could potentially give me if it was being nice. We'll see. Ah. The nineteen defense strives and it stays. Very happy well, about that. Uh, Very happy. Black Panther will attempt to crit hit you. Actually, mm. no. He will uh, he will attempt to break away with his leap climb mm. as well. Just so that he may live another day. Man, I hope you roll that one so bad. Sadly, no. Where was that one? Sad, I needed sadly, my, no. When I need my blades roll. Black Panther will go down here. Mm. So that he can still see things but not be seen. And then the two-gun kid. Don't count him out. He's still there. He's got range combat expert now. One damage. Nothing to be afraid of. He's he's sitting there pretty. Okay. Uh, so in an ideal world, Doomsday would crit hit you for eight this next turn. But I can't really count on an ideal world, nor can I count on rolling a ten to even deal you seven. If you, Sadly, as much if you as you were to crit hit this turn, that'd be really bad. <laughs> Super sense is the only thing I have to get out of an attack. That's exactly right, right, right. So I would love to crit hit you for seven. I think that would swing the game obviously immensely. And I really hate to let you have another turn to swing on Doomsday, but I think the smartest thing to do is to just clear Doomsday right now and let our 19 defense ride and hopefully stand strong. Type deal. So I, I do still have phasing, so I could just <laughs> straight now, phase away. Now, as we know, the coward's way out is not how <laughs> we play these games. We make attacks. Uh, there is no time limit. True. There's no reason to be phasing around. So the two gun kid's gonna have to get into the fray at some point. Uh, uh, yeah. There's no way I can do damage if I base Doomsday. So I'm gonna have to just hope that at some point the battle comes back down to level playing field. Uh, 
we will once again perplex up damage on Ziggy Stardust, and then he will use Close Combat Expert both into attack. 12 into a 19. Just need a 7. That's all. It's an average roll. That will hit. That'll do 2 damage afterwards. Correct. Which will take me exactly to click 3, exactly to stop. What's he got on stop? Is it just stop invuln? It is. Yeah, I mean, it's Doom can use invulnerability when you turn the dial, blah, 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 blah. Stop, basically. Yes. Okay. He has a 8-speed charge, 11 attack, super strength, 3 damage with exploit weakness. Oh. That is all I can do. I'll clear back mm-hmm. Panther. 2-gun kid, again. There's nowhere up on this elevated I can go and also use my range combat expert. And without yes. range combat expert... I can't really damage you, so I'm just going to wait until you oh, well. fall off. Using the heavy, because we need to. We need to deal at least five. As we know, dealing three is not a choice. So we're going to go ahead and have Doomsday. He now is up to an 11 attack, which is huge. Uh, 11 for three for five with the heavy. Going against Ziggy Stardust. Ah, Rolling a 16. Wasting our heavy object, which is a real shame for Mr. Day here. Not a fan. Not a fan. Well, Black Panther does have two damage, so this would be a good time to still be basing you. Except you would just kill my... kill my perplex. So I'm going to clear the only guy that can mm. damage you. Black Panther will perplex up his defense to a 20. Mm. And that'll be my turn. Doomsday will also clear, not wanting to literally push ever, to be honest with you, and especially <laughs> put you on to click four with no action tokens. What does Doomsday's feet do again? Uh, it literally just, when I move, I can destroy a piece of blocking terrain. Oh, okay, and, yeah. it. and, like, I always ignore, like, hindering. Like, that's it. I okay. thought it, I would, you know, that's, yeah, it's not as cool. Not very cool. Not, mm, not great. It'd be great on an indoor map. This one, not oh, a lot of yeah. blocking to, to worry sure. about. Um, Black Panther is going to have to, well, let's see. I know he's got a 12 in there somewhere. He I does. Really, I don't really want to hit him to that. So I'm just going to keep trying to hit him hard. So I'm going to perplex up damage again. Close combat expert all into, what's his defense? It is an 18 now. An 18. Uh, let me double check. Actually, no, it is a 17. It's a 17. Excuse me. Okay. We will go one and one then. So we will okay. we'll go 11 for 5, uh, trying to hit Doomsday. Because now all I need is a 6, and I can get a 6, right? Mm. There we go. You got it. For 5 reduced by 2, it takes me to click 6. That's my whole turn. I can't. <laughs> literally, mm. my other two mm. guys are all Legit. But useless at this Legit. point. Legit. <laughs> I mean, Black Panther could push to outwit and then outwit your defense, but mm. at this point, it's it's more likely mm. that he'll just die up there. Sadly, yes, probably. I am not in love with the stat modifications. Right now, I also don't just want to waste in, like, Leap Climb. Uh, I'm really angry that I probably should have got Doomsday into being based with this guy a lot sooner. I was I was really mad that he just regened off of that first really sick Batman hit. Uh, <laughs> that that was, still that salty about that. Um, yeah, I gotta say. Uh, yeah, this sucks. We are, we're still on 11 for 3. Don't really want to do the whole 3 damage right now. But I think Doomsday needs to make attacks. So Doomsday is going to go ahead and try to punch Ziggy Stardust for a crit hit. No, but that will hit. That does hit a 20. Does it, though? Does it, though? It does. It does, though. For three damage. That'll put me in Doomsday clear. will get an action token. Uh, I'm aware. Well so aware. This is where yeah. I decide... I don't know if this Doomsday, I, I think I've hit him to one stop click, right? Yes. But he's not on a current stop click, is he? I am not on a current stop click, no. So at this point, in my mind, I'm assuming that 
with my four damage pulse wave. I could move Black Panther out of the way. Single target pulse wave for four. It's probably not going to get through his stop click. It's probably just going to do like one damage. Um, and then that leaves him a real sweet way to like just knock me down dial. And I, I think I want to get back to my close combat expert. Mm. Thanks, I based. hate it. So I really hope you roll a one. As much as it pains me, I'm gonna have. To I hate it. everything about what you're about to say. I you really suck. Yeah. I really wish I yeah. could just pulse wave you for four. I mean, mm -hmm. if you didn't have those silly mm -hmm. stop clicks, instead mm -hmm. I'm gonna I'm gonna roll a, f a three. So I'll, ah. I'll heal up two clicks, go to click two. Not full, at least I and guess. Black Panther will use his wonderful perplex to bump my defense to a loser. A solid nineteen. Loser. Complete loser. Simeon Bruce. I'm gonna move I'm gonna move Black Panther down to here. Hate everything about a man named Simeon Bruce. <laughs> Doomsday's gonna clear. And by the way, you suck. Alright. <laughs> Perplexing up defense once again. I've gotta clear Ziggy Stardust. I'll also clear Black Panther. Because he did move, so he's got that Avengers team ability. He was able to move two squares. Yeah, 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 yeah. aware, aware. Uh, kind of didn't need the Avengers team ability to move a whole uh, two squares, but okay. Doomsday is seven. gonna swing on you again. We have an eleven. We need an eight. Did a nineteen. Let's get a crit hit, baby. We did roll a nine though. Pretty astronomical with these nines. We are rolling. If you fail super senses, you will not go to the shape uh, 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 the regen click, wave. which is really yeah, cool. Yeah. So I do need yeah, this, yeah, yeah, yeah. this super senses to stick. Yes, it doesn't. Yes, so I'll yes. Go click five instead. Uh, give myself an action token. Uh, and can I do you knockback with this? We're gonna do you knockback with super strength, Ooh. just to get you away from me. So I'll just which drop I should have done before when you we'll got on the down dumb two squares, okay. and then yeah. take two two blood token damage, right? I should have done this when whatever I have super strength whatever yes so you went to click five now you're on click seven that is correct and I'm up here <laughs> and you suck you fight and you are down All there right. and that is my turn I have one character on my team okay let's see now it's it's gonna be kind of I, I mean you still have some decent stuff going on but I, I've got hypersonic now Mm -hmm. So maybe there's still a chance. Which is uh, quite annoying, I must say. Uh, yeah. I'm going to have to put... What's your defense at? My still defense at like is... 17? Uh, 17 impervious. Okay. Impervious. Oof. Uh, we're going to perplex up my attack to a 10. Mm. I'm going to hypersonic up to right here. And I'm going to give you a good old punch in the head. So 10 into a 17. Mm, that will hit, or will it damage? It does. It does. It does get through for, for one. For one, I will Go attempt seven. to continue my hypersonic. Mm, got it. And let's see. That was that was one square that I moved. I've got a whole eight squares possible. So that's one. Let's go. Two, three, four, five. We'll go. We'll go right here. I feel like that's a safe area to be. And we will we'll go ahead and just keep it right there for now. Mm. Still have, I think, the only mm. thing really keeping me in this fight is the fact that he's got power cosmic, so I'm able to go twice yes, as often as you for without sure. taking those push damages. Uh, Doomsday will clear, because that's all, all he really wants to do. <laughs> all right, let's... Uh, Rinse and repeat. Black Panther will perplex up my attack again. I'll hypersonic three squares. Can we get the crit miss, ladies and gentlemen? This time. Crit misses are long overdue. Just saying. Just That'd throwing that out there. Oof. 18 Oof. for three if it hits. That will hit. Take me to click eight. All right. And then I will roll to try and get away. Uh oh. Ah! That's I'm what I like there. to see. So baby. I have. I still have super senses. 
Uh, but on click seven, it's a 16 defense instead mm -hmm. of that sweet 19. I that like it. Mm. Okay, and you have two tokens. Doomsday is going to go ahead and take a swing on you. He has a 10 attack with, that's right, you guessed it, super strength, ladies and gentlemen. So let's go ahead and have Doomsday swing. That will hit. Or will it? Uh, will. Haven't You'll made take a two. They'll take, take two, two, fall, and take two more. So I'll take four total, going from click seven. Uh, two, let's see, seven, one, two, one, two to death. That is the death of Iggy Star. Doomsday! EDM is not dead. Doomsday <laughs> is still an amazing song. Here we are. Baby, victory so, so I've close. Got, I've got two characters it. that can potentially do three damage it's just going to take me a lot more work than i'd like to oh yeah oh yeah i've got the one guy i have nothing else to say yeah. to me. uh man uh black panther will move to here oh <laughs> and he'll perplex up two gun yeah. kids defense okay and we'll see, we'll see, because okay. I'm definitely not going up there. I can't, <laughs> No, I figured. nothing good I can do up there. Doomsday uh, is going to have to clear, though. I will not be pushing to move the ridiculous, okay. things that are ridiculous, that. This is crazy, but I'm also going to clear Black Panther. Also perplexing up two gun kids, defense again, uh, man... This is going to be a rough ride. I, I feel move like there's still a chance. Squares into I the, feel I'm like going to move six squares into the hindering terrain here. There's just a chance. Uh, let's see. You fool. You forgot that I have double perplex. <laughs> uh, sidestep, two gun kid. Okay. All uh, right. That's enough of this. That's enough. Let's see. Two gun kid literally has one damage, uh, one printed damage. That's what I like to see. So even with a crit, do so you still have invulnerability? Your whole dial, you said. I do. I at least have a reducer by two. Invulnerability and or impervious. Yes. Black yeah, Panther. Maybe. Black Panther's not looking super great. Um, no, no, he's not. Let's just move. We'll move two gun kid half of the ways, and then we'll move Black Panther half of the ways. We'll perplex down your attack. Mm. Even though I don't think you have a moving attack, but uh, I do have case. charge. I have oh, charge, yeah. super strength, exploit, weakness. Oh, okay. right now. We'll we'll perplex down your attack then, for sure. Uh, and that'll be that turn. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, Doomsday is going to clear, because I don't want to push myself. Once again, ridiculous notion of someone to say such a thing. Yes, yes. Who would ever push themselves? Mm -hmm. Two gun kids going to make a shot. <laughs> uh, we're gonna we're gonna go ahead and. Uh, he's literally the only shot that we got right now because Black Panther yes. can't do anything. We'll go ahead and perplex up his damage by one. Two Gun Kid will use Range Combat Expert to increase his attack to a nine and his damage to a three. This will push him to click six. With a nine attack, I, how, how 16 many? 16 in Hindering Terrain. 16 with the Hindering? With, so, uh, with the Hindering, it's a 17. Oh, 17. So yes. I will need an 8. An 8. Ooh. Oof. Oof. Two gun kid. Uh, oof. Almost got gotcha. you. Mm. Almost got gotcha. you. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Yeah. Almost. But. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So I got to tell you something right now. Doomsday is feeling. Oh baby, he is feeling. 
No, he's feeling unstoppable, which allows me to ignore the effects of hindering terrain. So that way, when I charge, I can charge my full three, <laughs> which is great, uh, which is awesome. We're going to charge to here. And now I need to make the choice, the concrete choices that we're going to punch Black Panther, oh, I believe. I haven't made a single super sense this game. You are on four. So I've got a 16 super sense, I believe. Yes. We gotta punch you. Let's let's get rid of Mr. Panther, shall we? Ooh, baby. That'll do it. Seventeen. Super sense it says. Yes. For how much? For two whole damage. Sadly, Doomsday is not the damage dealing beast take he was to, before. Take me to click six. You've unlocked my special ability, which is known as outwit. Ah, I was worried about that, to be honest with you. <laughs> but here we are, <laughs> anyways. Problem is Without my perplex, I won't be able to get through your final stop click of invulnerability unless I crit hit you. Uh, Huzzah. So there's that. Actually, Black Panther does get blades on his last click, so there's a small chance. Uh, Black Panther will outwit Doomsday's defense, whatever that may be. Yes, invulnerability, uh, yes. He has a, what was it, a 9 attack, so... Let's go mm. nine into that uh, sixteen. Need a seven for two. You got it. I go to click number ten. He's got to be close. He's got to be close to dead. Uh, two gun kid can't do a whole lot, so he's got to clear. Ooh, I don't like this at all. Mm. I feel like Doomsday should, should should push. Feel like he's in a tough to spot. <laughs> so I really don't want anyone hitting me, honestly. I think Black Panther's the biggest threat. I get rid of that outwit. The game is pretty much won. Because then Two Gun Kid just can't damage me ever. So oh. we're gonna take the push. Close combat expert all into attack and eleven to try to take out Black Panther here. You need a four, I believe. A crit yes. miss at this point would be If I pushed a crit perfect. miss, I would be livid. I would be livid. Uh, but a 5 instead. So that will hit my 15. I do still have super senses. If I was going to get it at any point in the game, this would be a great time to get super no! senses. No! No! That sucks. <laughs> and I got to be honest with you, that probably cost me the game, you missing the super senses. I was banking it on a single dice roll. I do push to 11. It is your turn, well, man. Again, does that suck? It sucks. Uh, Black Panther's got a locked two damage his whole dial, and Two Gun Kid is at one damage yes. with range combat expert. So yeah. I can't deal two damage unless I can somehow crit hit you. Uh, Black Panther does have blades on his next click. Uh, so there's a small chance, but you'll clear before I do. So I think my only great shot right now, because I can't outwit you. You're on a stop click right now. Is that right? Oh, I am not. You're not on a stop click. Oh. No. Oh, so he's just got invulnerability. Yes. No, well, he, hasn't case. he hasn't purpose. He hasn't but it doesn't really matter now, does it? I will I will outwit that. Yeah, that's right. No, I, I only will, have two uh, stops. Three and seven. The click number 11 is not a stop, sadly. Two-gun kid is going to use his eight attack to try and hit. What's Sorry, your defense? I have a 17. <laughs> Oh, I need a big old nine. Come on. That's oh, a four. Thank goodness. Let's keep those rolls like that, shall we? I think... Oh, man. I can't afford to push Black Panther. And I don't really need to. Because if I push Black Panther... Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. <laughs> if I push Black Panther, he... No, he keeps his outwit. So I could push him. Ah, uh, man. No, we're we're gonna clear him. All we're right, we're gonna clear him for now. Then Doomsday will also senses. have to clear. All right, we're gonna outwit your defense. Yes. Black Panther's got a nine. He's got two damage. Need needs something oh, higher than goodness. that. Thank goodness. I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna push the two gun kid. He's oh, been baby. doing it the whole game. The two gun kid. If he if he hits, he doesn't die. If he misses, he will die. So, let's see. I've got an 8 attack. Need a big number. Oh, thank That's goodness it wasn't That's not hit. a big number. 
All right. You're playing my my heartstrings are being like they're being like it's like a harp like ding, like I'm like I am on edge. This is tough. Yeah, yeah. I've got Doomsday. A, got one. Got one left I got me. one move to make, and it's punch Black Panther. I have a nine attack. He's got a fifteen defense. He's got super senses. I just I need a six or. If the universe wants to grant me one more crit hit, I wouldn't complain. Oh my gosh! Baby! Ooh! <laughs> Ooh! So, bro! Doomsday! Bah. Uh, wow! Wow! Impossible. <laughs> Bringing home the win. I cannot Doomsday believe you stole the, the first game of this new season. It's final click. Away from Second me like that. Second season of Thursday Throwdown. Doomsday wins. We The Superman killer himself has taken out Black Panther. One man. One single man. Ooh. That's what I thought. When idiot. I got that Stupid. Super sense <laughs> Either way, don't, don't rob me of this crit hit. It is so dope, Simeon. One figure left on my team. I managed to take out three characters of it. Well, one one killed themselves. Either way. Just just one crit miss is all I, I needed you to do. This and, is, uh, and instead you had like three crit hits. You had what an a, insane amount of crit hits. So I, many high rolls. So many high rolls. Uh, this, to me, this game was in crazy. In the last couple of games, I pushed to crit miss and kill my last figure twice in the in the last couple of games here. Well, no, Hulk was in the last or whatever, but I pushed and crit missed with Colonel America, pushed and crit missed with KC Superman, right? So, Doomsday getting the crit hit to make you not even have to roll super senses is the uh, chef's kiss, piece of the resistance. I am up <laughs> to six wins against Simeon's four. Uh, this is the first win of the new series, and I am loving it. So, <laughs> we do Thursday Throwdown. Every Thursday, we put it up. We upload it here on YouTube, and if you liked this game, which, how could you not? This was an insane, insane game uh, this game probably took like an hour and a half, if not longer. This is probably the longest Thursday throwdown yet, I must say. And it, yeah, for sure, it was it, it was, was a higher point game. It was also uh, but not our highest. Yeah, we had so, we had some uh, some some crazy stuff going on. So I I really want to thank. See, I didn't write down who voted for Doomsday, but thank you. I I believe it. I'm gonna go to Twitter and say it. But first of all, we go. And we record Wednesday or Tuesday before Thursday here. And then we upload on Thursday. And if you like this, go ahead and vote on Facebook or Twitter or Discord if you're part of our Patreon. And you can help make the magic of Thursday Throwdown by voting for what characters you want to see or the, us Or in the YouTube play. comments if you're watching or the YouTube this on YouTube. That is fine as well. Yeah. Which, I mean, that's, that's the only place you can watch this. Uh, wow. As How'd far you know? as I know. I don't know. Uh, I want to thank Ben Jones for the vote for Doomsday. Thank you, Ben Jones, uh, for making sure I got an absolute beast monster figure on my team. Next week, uh, I will be building out of Mutations and Monsters. Simeon will be building out of Crisis. Simeon, give us three figures that you are you would like to potentially play from Crisis, or at least three figures you think were cool from that set. So, from Crisis, this is a figure that's on my shelf right now. This is a figure that... We all know and love. That's good old Uncle Sam, number 035. He's a unique rare. Let's look at what he does. Well, first off, he's got a 10 attack, 4 damage, 140 points. Look at this guy rolling up his sleeves, stars and stripes. I think he sold beef or something. I don't know the history. Uh, cool hat. He's got a special attack power. Give me your tired, your poor. That's Lady Liberty's line, Uncle Sam. Uh, when Uncle Sam makes a close combat attack, modify his attack value plus one for each friendly character four or fewer squares away to which Uncle Sam can draw a clear line of fire, and that is marked with one or more action token. So he's clearly able to bump his attack up a little bit right there. Uh, later on, on clicks 2, 3, and 4, he gets as big as my country. Uncle Sam has the giant damage symbol. So you make him mad, he gets real big and bad. I do uh, like that. It's cool. I, yeah, he's he's such a fun figure. I've only played him once. Um, it's been a long time. So he's he's mostly a shelf piece. But uh, as you can see, his dial's not bad. Um, he's got some lots of lots of potential. He's got some uh, support in the, like, the very end with some regen and some phasing. Mm -hmm. He does have that weird hyper. And all his powers kind of are thing. really cool. Uh, named powers too. Yeah. They're all clever. So I like Uncle Sam a lot. Yeah. 
Next up, out of Crisis, I'm I'm gonna go Crisis. <laughs> Crisis. <laughs> Crisis. I'm gonna go down, and uh, I think. Oh man, I think I think I want to say the Specter. I think I changed my mind, and we're gonna we're gonna <laughs> go with the Specter. So Ooh, wow, this guy. Yeah. He's got that classic sculpt where he's in like the the graveyard or wherever. He's got quintessence, ten range, one lightning bolt, eleven attack, super strength. He's got ghostly guardian. He can use charge, phasing teleport, and the Justice Society team ability, which is great on click two if you give me some more Justice Society or wild cards because I can share yeah. that nineteen defense. Uh, later on in his dial, after his free gen mid dial, uh, he gets vengeance. Give the specter a power action to make a close combat or ranged combat attack, replacing his damage value with the damage value of his target until the action is resolved. The attack is penetrating damage, which he's got a three. That's fair. If he swaps it for a three or a four, that's penetrating damage. And, uh, especially on like these last clicks where he's got steel energy and he needs to heal back up. It's pretty sweet stuff for 234 points. And then uh, last but not least, we're going with the Thunderer of Cord. Y'all know and love him. He was in the World of Light. War of Light. World of Light. Uh, he was in War of Light, but this is not the War... Uh, what was he? What was the name? <laughs> Weaponer. He's the Weaponer. Weaponer. <laughs> he was the Weaponer of Cord <laughs> in uh, War of Light. This is the Thunderer of Cord. Uh, the little brother, you might say, to the Weaponer. Uh, I'd he's... say more like Thunder Thighs of Cord. Goodness <laughs> gracious, this guy. So he's got the Quabolts. He's <laughs> such a great power. He's got Running Shot Quabolts. Uh, Thunder of Cord can use <laughs> Energy Explosion. When he is given a ranged combat action, you can choose one of the following options. Modify the range value of his current unmodified damage value. Or two, so you can modify it by two. Or two... Damage from the attack is penetrating damage. So, uh, good old penetrating energy explosion kind of guy uh, with regular energy explosion on his end dial. Look at that. He's got a lightning bolt or something. Yeah. It's the shield that does all the work. I, that visor, uh, you can't see anything. It's like the goggles. He wears his sunglasses at night. I can, I can tell that's the kind of guy he is. Oh, yeah. I'm building out of mutations and monsters. Guess what, guys? There are zombies in the set, so you already know it's a build for. But I actually am only going to talk about one of them. 047 is my first pick. I absolutely love this sculpt, and it's a figure I own. It's the Super Adaptoid. Uh, he's he's just great. He has two cool special powers. I'm not going to read them because they're super lengthy, but he's a giant. He has like <clears throat> really cool mixed-in Earthbound Neutralize. He's also Hydra, which is great. Because he can see over people, which gives him just better better everything for Hydra. Next up, 056 Wolverine, which is a zombie who I absolutely love. This is the only zombie that got to be power cosmic. So out of all the zombies they they made, later on in the story, like at the end of the first run, really, they all become power cosmic, the Ecolactus. So this guy's got running shot. Pen blast. He's got a range. He has exploit weakness, which is great, and then he has steel energy down dial with some really solid values, and then of course power cosmic just being amazing. Also, great, great sculpt. And Wolverine's missing that arm because he kind of hacked like, his arm off. Kind of looks like uh, he's wearing like Galactus's uh, armor. Yeah, no, exactly what he is. So after they all ate Galactus, they all like had Galactus armor for some really? reason. Which one was and it that was missing the bottom half of their torso? And just... that was Iron Man. I know oh. was missing his legs, but yeah. he used like Galactus's like cosmic power to like yep. shoot out thrusters yeah. out of, and his, he sort like, of flew legs. around normally. And then also Spider Man was missing just one of his legs. Uh, going back up to zero zero six double oh six here, Pete Wisdom. Not that he's good or anything. For thirty three points, he's solid. Stealth, energy explosion, two damage, six range, great. But the best part is that Hot Knives on his card was just called Orange. So you know how they say the power next to them is energy explosion, but it just said orange. So he's going to hit you with that <laughs> orange, ladies and gentlemen. But yeah, good old Pete Wisdom, really cool, great Pete guy. Wisdom. So one of the one of the weakest psychics in all of comics, I believe. Yeah, uh, apparently he's like Psylocke like, with like his uh, little finger blades. Secret agent man. You know, even V W L L S says hot knives orange, baby. Hot knives orange. There you go. Don't know what that some, means, but yeah, hot knives. 2010 orange. action coming at you. Oh yeah! All right, so but those are the 
Uh, what is yes, orange? Is. Oh my gosh, orange is broken. Boys, kids, fix orange. Uh, those are the next two sets we're going to be building out of Mutations and Monsters and Crisis. Obviously, if you don't know this already, we are a Hero Clicks podcast. You can download it at Podbean, iTunes, anywhere podcasts are found here on the YouTube channel. Thank you guys so much for checking out the YouTube channel. Tell all your friends if you enjoyed this uh, Thursday throwdown. And I hope everybody has a great week. We'll catch you in the next one. Happy trails.